Welcome back to another Seattle Seahawks franchise. Today, the Seattle Seahawks will be going up against the Arizona Cardinals. The Seahawks will come into this one at an 8-0 perfect record. But the Arizona Cardinals are a 1-7 on the season. Their season has definitely not... Ha, it definitely hasn't gone as planned. Definitely with a win, with a loss today would easily diminish their chances of a playoff hope. Their hopes are already basically over. Their season's basically going for that number one draft pick if you really look at it. But the Seahawks come into this one obviously running the whole entire NFL. Number one in the league. Best team in the league. And they would love to continue that today in their home stadium. Russell Wilson comes in today 67.6% .6 completion percentage, 2474 yards, 18 touchdowns, and only seven interceptions. We like to get that down. Hand out to Marshawn Lynch for a second and seven. He will pick up the first down. We move to our own 35 now on our own 35, second and five. Wilson drops back to pass. He's going to find Jimmy Graham to the left side. Jimmy Graham has one defender to beat. Can he beat him? He cannot do so successfully, but we do get to their 39. A first and 10 now. 9.50 remains in the first quarter. Wilson drops back to pass. He's going to roll it to his right. He's going to take it himself. He's getting to the 30, and he's going to run out in the out, run out run at the 25. We're on their 25 now. 9.20 remains. The Seahawks are trying to get into the end zone on their first possession. Wilson drops back to pass. He's rolling out to the right once more. Rolling back left. He's going to fumble it. Can Russell Okun get onto it? Yes, he will. That was actually Alvin Bailey, my bad. <laughs> but Okung did get on it. Second and 15 now. Bullet pass thrown to Jermaine Curse to the right side. Jermaine Curse is picking up the reception, his first reception of the day. A third and two. The Seahawks on the 17. Handing out to Marshawn Lynch. And we move to a sec they move to a second and 17 now. Wilson drops back to pass. He's thrown to the right, finding Chris Matthews for the end zone. Chris Matthews get into the, gets into the end zone. I think that's his fifth on the season, if I'm not mistaken. And Chris Matthews is having a better season than he did last year. He's getting a lot more playing time. And this was just a great route by him getting in front of the defender, having the lines guy get in the way of the camera angle. But a good job by Chris Matthews getting into the end zone for the first score of the day by the Seahawks. Carson Palmer were coming to this game. Writing some stats that are mediocre at best. 56.5% completion percentage, 2135 yards, 11 touchdowns, and 5 interceptions. He'd like to continue doing... He'd like to do something better in this game, that's for sure. A 39 now. Palmer is going to find Brown. Brown will not be able to get the first down. He got very close, but it's not good enough. A second and five now on our own 37. We get the ball. Marshawn Lynch is running up the middle and finding eight yards. We are now on our own 43, second and 13. Four minutes remain in this first quarter. It's going to be thrown to Marshawn Lynch on the halfback screen. He will get to about the 48. It's now a third and three. We're on their 48. Play action. Wilson getting ready to roll around, try and do something, but he's going to be sacked immediately by Riddick. Riddick would pick up his first sack of the day. It would force us to punt a second and nine. Now handing off to Stephen Taylor. Stephen Taylor is going to get to only a yard. It's now a third and eight on their own six. They're backed up in their own end zone. Palmer dropping back to pass. Can Bennett get the t sack for the safety camp? But Fitzgerald almost comes down with that pass. Great job by Richard Sherman to get the ball out of his hands. It's now a third and 11. Wilson dropping back to pass once more. He's going to do a nice duke. Try to get to the 40. We cannot do it. And we would have punt the ball away. But this time they're on their own two. Nine seconds left in this first quarter. Hand out to, Paul, to Taylor. It's going to be a hit down. Boy, that was a weird crack right there in my voice or loud voice. But Michael Bennett would get the tackle on Stephen Taylor. He is having a terrible game today. It's a punt. And Tyler Lockett is getting the punt. Tyler Lockett. Here we go. First juke. Getting one juke. Here he goes. Another juke. Getting more players to just basically go on the ground. And Tyler Lockett has all the space in front of him for a touchdown. We get a nine-point trip if you look at it that way. We get two points. For the safety and the touchdown by Tyler Lockett, an amazing touchdown by him. He's not only looking good in this game, but in real life, he is looking absolutely amazing. I'm so excited for the season ahead that he has. He could easily get Offensive Rookie of the Year by just the play that he's had in preseason. First and 10 now. Palmer drops back to pass. 
He's going to find Nicholas over to the right side. He will not pick up a first down. He picks up six, second and four. We've allowed one rushing yard through a quarter. On their own 40, throwing to the right, finding Fitzgerald, who will get to the 40-yard line. Their passing game is definitely doing decent, but their running game has been non-existent. Second and 21 now on their own 49. Palmer getting ready to call another play here. He, we're still waiting. <laughs> Palmer dropping back to pass. He's looking around, trying to find somebody, throwing to the left, finding nobody actually he will he will find find whoever that was could not figure out who that was third and six now palmer throwing to the left finding nothing but a fourth down they would settle for three though now we're on our own 20 the next drive wilson finding chris matthews but he cannot hang on to the ball he gets hit hard third and five now on our own 25 baldwin the man in motion Wilson drops back to pass. He's going to roll out to his left and take it himself. Here he goes. He's going to slide into the ground, pick up nine yards. We're having a better running game with our quarterback than they are with their running back. First and ten now. Wilson lobs it into the air to Jimmy Graham. Jimmy Graham is just having a good game to start out today's game as he picks up his second reception of the day. Second and six now. We're on their 41 play action. Wilson drops back to pass. He's going to stop and not be able to find Luke Wilson just overthrew him there. Third and six now. We're on there. 41. Curse the man in motion. Wilson drops back to pass. He's going to lob it into the air. Finding Jermaine Curse, who will pick up the first down. We move to their 27. We're on now. We're now. We're now on their 20. Second and three. And out to Marshawn Lynch. Marshawn Lynch. Here he goes. He cannot get into the end zone, but he's having a good game so far. It's his second and goal. We're going to run kind of a hitch route with everybody. We're on their one. Wilson's just going to take it himself. Can he get into the end zone? He will. Russell Wilson will pick up another rushing touchdown on the season. I'm not sure how many he has so far, but he definitely has quite a bit. If you look at the stat sheet so far, it's been a good season overall for him and the whole entire offense. The defense is getting better each week. This week so far, they are doing great. 430 remains in the first half. It's going to be a play action. Palmer's going to throw it to the right and find Fitzgerald. Sherman is going to try and run him down. He will. But it is the damage has been done on that play. They move to our 22. Palmer getting ready to hike the ball here. Play action once again. Palmer dropping back to pass. Throwing to the left. Finding Brown. But it's going to be knocked out by our defenders. Could not see who that was. It is now a third and sixth. They're on our 18. Brown the man in motion. Palmer drops back to pass. He's looking around. Still looking around. It's going to be incomplete. They would settle for three once again. It's another play action by us. We're on our own 22. Wilson rolling out to his right. He's waiting. Finding Jimmy Graham. A huge throw. Can Graham beat this man? He cannot. But he picks up a huge reception. That would be his third reception of the day. First and 10 now. We're on their 23. Wilson drops back to pass. He's going to take it himself again. He sees a bunch of open field. He's going to slide and make the defenders just fly in the air. We move to their 10 now. First and 10. Two-minute warning. Wilson high pass to Doug Baldwin. He makes the reception. Doug Baldwin in the back of the end zone. Leaping high in the air to make the reception. Aggressive catch may be overpowered. Getting in front of Denard, I believe. And able to make this reception right in front of him. An amazing play by Doug Baldwin being able to stay with it. It was a high pass by me. I thought I'd try it. It did work out successfully. And now Cardinals come out on their own 27 trying to figure something out on offense. His defense has been terrible and so is offense. But who knows, they can get a touchdown here and easily be right back into it as they will receive the ball in the second half, if I'm not mistaken. So they are now on our 36, now a second and 10. Palmer drops back to pass. He's looking around. He's going to find Spadola over the middle, and he will not pick up the first down, but he does get to a third and four now. They're on our 30, throwing to the right, finding Fitzgerald. Fitzgerald is getting pushed back, but it's going to be good enough for a first down. They move to our 23, second and 10. Palmer drops back to pass. He's looking around, finding Fitzgerald, but Sherman will knock the ball out once more. It's now a third and ten. Palmer drops back to pass. He's looking around, trying to pick up a first down. He won't. Thomas was able to hit his head or something to be able to have the ball knocked out. It's a first and ten now on our own 31. Wilson dropping back to pass. He's trying to get Graham, but he just could not do it. And that would do it for the first half. This game has been a good game so far for the Seahawks. Not really an exciting game for a primetime game. But other than that, it's been a huge game for the Seahawks on offense and defense. So far, everything is working on all cylinders. 
The Arizona Cardinals have not done anything successfully today except the passing, but four rushing yards in this game is not going to cut it. So they have to definitely get going in the second half, and they will start off here trying to get that going, try to get a good running game, but it does not work out well to start off the half. Here comes Stephen Taylor on his next run, and this one is the best run of the day, which goes for five. Third and six on their own, 24. Palmer dropping back the pass. He's going to find Spadola over the middle. He will pick up a first down and move to the 39. It was a pickup of 15. First and 10 on their own, 39. Now Palmer handing off to Stephen Taylor. They're trying to make some tone setter with that run game, but it's not working out at all. Third and seven on their own, 42. Palmer drops that to pass. He's looking around. He's throwing to the right, finding Fitzgerald almost. Fitzgerald cannot get the reception. And the Seahawks will get the ball back. Or will get the ball for the first time in the second half. Wilson is going to take it. And he's going to be thrown to the ground by 91 or Shaughnessy. I believe that's how you say it. It's a second and 17 now on our own 20. Wilson finding Jermaine Curse. If Curse is able to get off the defender, that one defender, he's probably going in for six. First and 10 now on our own 42. Heading out to Marshawn Lynch. Marshawn Lynch running out to the right side. He will not pick up the first down. We went to their 49. Third and one now. We're going to hand out to Marshawn Lynch. He's going to pick up the yard and get a little bit extra with it. Moving to the 38 now. First and 20 play action. Wilson dropping back to pass. He's looking around. He's rolling out to his right. He's just going to throw it to Chris Matthews. I almost said Clay Matthews. And Chris Matthews would pick up the reception. And we get closer to a first down. A second and nine now. Wilson drops back to pass. A bullet pass to Ricardo Lockett. Ricardo Lockett is being TD Lockett. Tyler Lockett, if you guys are... Do you not know that? The Lockets have two different names. One Lockett, which is Tyler, has no E at the end. And Ricardo Lockett, the one who just caught the pass, has an E at, his end, at the end of his name. So it is a touchdown. They were both right next to each other as well. So it's a touchdown for Ricardo. If I'm not mistaken, that's probably his first of the year. On their own 20, trying to establish a run game, and it is just not working out at all for them. 10 rushes, 7 yards on the day for Stephen Taylor. On their own 20 now, heading off to Taylor again. And this one's going to be a loss of two. 11 rushes and five yards. It has not been a good day for them at all. This one's going to be thrown to the left, though. Their passing game has been their backbone of their team so far today. But it hasn't been great either. It's been good, but it definitely isn't good enough as they are down by several scores in this one. This one's going to be thrown to Brown, though. It would be another first down. They move to their own 44 now. First and 10. They're going to hand it off to Taylor. And Taylor is stuffed as soon as he is getting the ball it's a loss of four and now on their own 40 third and 14 if that's, if that's actually 12 rushes in one yard this one's thrown to the left it's going to be almost caught by Fitzgerald again he is dropping the ball not able to hang on it's now a second and five we get the ball back on our own 27 Wilson changed the play at the line of scrimmage trying to do something with the defense he's going to find Chris Matthews Chris Matthews is going to pick up 17 on the play they move to the, we move to our own 44 as the Seahawks are definitely cruising in this one as we look at the score here 37 to 9 it's a huge deficit that the Cardinals are going to have to come overcome if they even want to win and there's only one quarter left second and 10 now on our own 44 we're going to be running another play action Wilson dropping back to pass he's going to roll a little bit to his right he's going to stop find Buchanan Buchanan is able to intercept the pass and he will definitely a poor decision by me to throw that pass Russell Wilson should have never thrown it I should have never thrown that pass I mean it was just a bad decision I should probably just be running out the clock it's almost it's essentially game time it's it's over this is just time that's essentially just to run out the clock but I do not do not do that I believe that is Buchanan if I'm not right sorry <laughs> my bad anyways Fitzgerald is going to get the reception and pick up a first down they move to our 32 Palmer is getting ready for another pass play here. He drops back to pass. He's looking around. He's going to throw to his right. Find Brown, but he won't be able to hang on. Richard Sherman is able to knock the ball out of his hands. Now a third and nine. They're on our 32. Palmer drops back to pass. Wagner is going to hit Brown hard, and that would be a tackle. On that play, Wagner would jump off sides, and they would essentially get the yards that were needed for a first down instead of three points. But once again... Actually, I'm not even sure if that happened. That might have been in a different game. Sorry, but anyways, they do get points again. Imagine if that's four touchdowns. It would be a 28-37 game, 
even though they'd still be out of it by nine points, they'd be a lot closer than what they are currently, which is 25 points. So we're on their 41 now. Lynch is going to get the handoff. Lynch is going down the field. Can Lynch beat one more defender? He gets into the end zone. Marshawn Lynch, the 41-yard touchdown run by Marshawn Lynch. He is just on fire this season. As you see at the bottom of the screen, he is very close to getting the 1,000-yard mark. As we can see, 980 rushing yards so far. Three yards rushing for the Cardinals. 233 for the Seahawks. First and 10 on their own 22. Palmer throwing to his left, finding Brown. Kerry Williams cannot get in front of him. And they will move to their own 38 now, second and five. Palmer drops back to pass with a halfback screen, finding Taylor. Taylor is just having a bad day all around, both on the passing game and the running game. 39 now on their own 35. Palmer drops back to pass. He's looking around. He's throwing to the left, and he's going to find Brown, who will pick up a first down. He's definitely been the positive note of this offense today. Now, on the 35 of Seattle, 44-12. to Palmer drops back to pass. He's going to be sacked by Michael Bennett. It's been a tough game for Palmer and the rest of the team today. This is basically just injury time. It's essentially over, 3rd and 12 now, and now they are on our 37. Palmer drops like the pass. He's looking around, throwing to the right. Sherman is going to try and intercept the ball, but he cannot do it. It's now a third and seven. This one is essentially over. We're just going to run down the clock here on our own 23. We're going to run the play action. Third and seven. Wilson drops back to pass. He's going to throw it to the left and find Jimmy Graham. It wasn't a play action, but we do get extra yards. Third and six now. Last play of the game. We call it a timeout on our own 42. Wilson lobbing it in the air to Doug Baldwin, making another terrific catch of the day. Second one of the day. His second terrific catch, that's for sure. And now that would do it for the Seattle Seahawks game. They would win this one 44 to 15. A huge victory at home in prime time. And the Seahawks will move to 9-0. and The St. The St. Louis Cardinals, the Arizona Cardinals, will move to 1-8 and on the season. As that man right there, their coach, is definitely in the hot seat because they had high expectations for this season. And to go 1-8 and is definitely a down, down season to what they were expected to do. And in real life, they will be nowhere near that. I'm almost positive. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.